Hey guys, welcome back to Bass Boxing Outdoors. Day I got home and on the doorsteps was this big old box right here from Shop Carl's. Uh, for those of y'all that don't know what Shop Carl's is, uh, it's where you get your mystery tackle box from. Uh, they make their own baits, they sell baits, they do it all. Anyways, I'm a member of Shop Carl's, and uh, so I get a big discount on uh, baits and stuff like that, especially around this time of the year. They do the Black Friday, and they always have some kind of discounts. And Anyways, uh, Shop Carl's, they always uh, make up these kind of like mystery tackle boxes you can buy, and they give them different names and stuff like that. And you pay so much for each box and you get what you want. Some of them, they show you what you get and some of them, they don't. I normally buy the ones that they don't because to me, it's more interesting. It's more fun. Just It's a surprise, you know? So anyways, today we we're unboxing this, this box and this box is called the uh, Mystery Grab Bag. And it cost me $28 plus tax. And uh, I don't know what's in there. That's why I got it. I like it like that. And uh, anyways, I was going to say, if you're not a member of Shop Carl's, you might want to look into it. You pay, I think, a $40 fee every year. And like I said, you get a lot of discounts. And you can get these baits for really cheap. Uh a lot of Guggen brands. I mean, uh, there's a lot of the top of the line brands on there too. But uh, anyways, we're gonna dive into this box and see what this box is all about. All right. <clears throat> I am kind of curious to why they sent it in such a big box though. Don't need all that. Really? Alright, so they send it in another box. That's about like trying to tease somebody with a Christmas present. So anyways, you can see on here. Right there, it says mystery grab bag. And this is the bass box. They have a fresh water the bass only and a salt water i've gotten one of these before earlier this summer and it was a really good box that's why i went back and got another one because the last time they had it on there i went back to go buy one and they didn't have no more left so anyways i went ahead and got one this time and this one does say the november 2020 so that's interesting to know I hope this one's as good as the first couple that I've got. Ooh. I think I'm gonna like this box. This might be the better one, I don't know. Let's get in here and find out. And uh, first off, you got your little sticker. I do like that sticker, I've got it right there. Uh, I'm gonna look and see if there's any uh, what's in the box. Okay, so they don't have that in here, this, okay. Uh, First up, we have Amazing Baits, Carl's Amazing Baits, the Shiver Crank, dives 6 to 10 feet, and it's in a moonlight shed. So, uh, yeah, this is an interesting color. I'm going to move y'all forward. Uh... I always like getting crankbaits, so can't go wrong there. Uh, I've not, I have not really fished their brand, the Amazing Coral brand, but I do like this profile of a uh, crankbait. It kind of reminds me of a uh, the Strike King. Uh, I'm not sure what the the Strike King uh, brand that is, but 
they do Strat King has one that's almost just like this. They actually have a couple of them, but anyways, that's a real nice color. It's got the see-through body with the blue on the top. Uh a really nice blue on the top. In fact, I don't know if the camera's gonna do it any justice, but that's a real nice color. I like that. So I might have to give that a shot. Uh, so yeah, that's not bad. I know these right here run about four dollars and something on Shop Carl's. I do know that. Next up, we have the Leventons. The Leventons Lures. Uh, Randy Howe. This is an interesting looking crankbait. Uh. It has the EBS technology, electronic bait fish sound. Uh, this one is the Hawaiian punch color. It's five eighths ounce, two and a half inches long, and dives up to 10 feet. And I like the color on this one too. That's a real nice color. I'm not big on the electronic sound whatever they say it that does make some kind of bait noise in the water i'm not big on that i could really care less but i do like the color of this lure so anyways real nice lure it's a blue white with some red dots on it big bright red eyes with that little red hook in the front which is basically their kill spot for a bass and whenever they see that it uh triggers them to bite that section of the body i guess that's what a lot of people say anyways i don't care about red hooks i mean if it helps it helps if it don't it don't but this is a uh, really well made crankbait it don't seem to be made cheaply and all in all it's got a nice profile to it it's got the gill plates on there it's got a little indention, indention like the backbone it's got a real pretty blue on the top so all in all i'm impressed i like it i've gotten a bunch of their lures in these boxes and uh i know they got a top water that i got out of one of them and it was a real nice one and it worked really good i caught a few strappers off of it uh so yeah that's another good lure all right next up we have some of uh, uh, carl's amazing baits flicker worm and it's a six inch big texan seven pack so once again like i said i've never really you shot uh, the amazing coral baits okay so that's interesting that's a weird looking design it's got the real thick top a skinny tail and a thick bottom part uh nice color it's a uh, brown brown on the bottom black and red flake on the top seems to have a lot of action to it i bet that puts off a lot of action with that tail and that being so thin right there and being tight so thick on the bottom that ought to create create a lot of action through the water we might have to put that one in the tank and see how it uh looks in underwater because i'm curious to see how that does so anyways that was uh an interesting looking bait it's a six inch worm i can see why they call it the flicker hmm. not bad not bad next up oh i love these i love these i'm glad i got these i was just actually about to buy some more of these uh yesterday 
These are the 10,000 uh, fish saw crawl. And these are in a green pumpkin four inch seven pack. And uh, for those of y'all that uh, like crawl baits, and if y'all ain't tried these, y'all need to. These things are awesome. I really like them. The smell on them's good. The actions on them good. The profile of the bait is good. So, and it all comes. Ooh, that one's got that real strong garlic smell to it. These things right here put off a lot of action. You can actually go back in one of my videos and one of the tank videos and see how well this one uh, paired up. But this one right here catches a lot of fish. It's real good bait. And I don't have this color. So all in all, I'm happy with that good profile uh they've got these on sale right now for those of y'all that want to try try them out get over there they got that cyber monday sale going on and you can get them for pretty cheap normally they run about five dollars a pack and right now they're on sale for like two dollars and 49 cents or something like that so uh yeah so that's the saw crawl and uh, like I said, I love those. Next up, we got something I ain't ever gotten before. This is, uh, wow. This is neat. Perfection Lures. These are the six inch pre-rigged Nico. The best lure on tour, weighted, rigged, and ready to go. All right, so, wow. That's interesting. So yeah, these uh these uh worms come with a split ring and a hook with the wacky hook and nail weight already included. And uh you got one weedless hook and then one regular hook. Uh so yeah, that's that's really cool. I like that. That's uh interesting. I imagine that right there probably cost a pretty little penny for that whole little kit. That's probably where most of the value went on this box. So yeah, that's interesting. I've never gotten this in a box before. Definitely might have to try one of these out in the tank and see what they look like. Huh. So anyways, uh, it comes in. It doesn't say what color. Uh, if I had to guess, this is probably going to be a pumpkin. Yeah. So anyways, so that's cool. <clears throat> I'm impressed with that. I'm excited to get that. Like I said, it already comes rigged. It's already got the little, these are like, uh, yeah. So these are little metal split rings instead of the rubber band. And, uh, like I said, you get a hook two hooks you get a weedless hook plus the regular hook and they're already ready to go they got the little lead what or the little nail weights already inserted oh and it is a green pumpkin right there's the color okay so not bad not bad at all and then next up we got some uh carl's amazing stash bullet weights green pumpkin five pack Three sixteenths of an ounce. Can't ever go wrong with that. We all need bullet weights. Especially if you're going I just want to see one of these. See what they look like. Alright. So yeah, basically it's just your regular old bullet weight. And it's painted green pumpkin. Nothing special. But, like I said, you can't ever go wrong with that, especially whenever, you know, you're going to Texas rig it. Three sixteenths of an ounce. That's about what I use. Five pack. Good deal. Now, these are interesting. I am excited about these. And this is another one from the same company, that Perfection Lures. These are the Shaky Head three sixteenths of an ounce. 
green pumpkin and these are the stand-up jigs i've seen these made by somebody else uh i forgot what they're what the uh, forgot what the name of the company was but uh these right here have like a uh antenna i know somebody out there knows what i'm talking about but they got like a little antenna you can see them in the pack there's a little antenna that sits there and every time that you drop it, it it makes that lure stand perfectly up without falling over i do know that uh, a lot of people have complained that the little antennas break pretty easily and uh so that's one bad thing about it and these are in a 3 16th of an ounce it's a three pack and i'm willing to bet this right here was probably pretty expensive it shows you all the different ways you can rig it and so anyways there's this you can see the little antennas in there and basically what it does is it pins that head and that hook to where it stands straight up which is really interesting i like that i might have to try them out i like shaky heads and those are cool so like I said, normally I get more baits and stuff in these boxes. I've got another one of these exact bait boxes coming. I'm curious to see if they're going to be the same, if they're going to be different. But I'm impressed with it. I think for $28, you really can't complain, especially with the uh, terminal tackle that you got and that little kit. That's a pretty good deal. So anyways, like I said, we got the saw crawls. We got the amazing, uh, Carl's amazing baits, the flicker worm. And then we got this little kit, the Nico kit. Which, and then we got the Livington lure, the crankbait. And then we got the Carl's amazing crankbait. And this was the Shimmer Shad, I believe. The Shiver Crank. Okay. And then we got the Shaky Worm Heads, the Stand Up Jig. And that's a three pack. And then we got the Bullet Weights. And then, of course, our little sticker. So, yeah. I think all in all, that was a pretty good box for $28. Uh,. I do think that they could have put a little bit more bait in there, but like I said, I think that little worm kit and the terminal tackle probably took up most of the value. And I'm willing to bet that Livington lure probably took up a lot of the value too. I think that crankbait's like 10 or $11 by itself. I might be wrong, but I think they're pretty expensive. Uh, so all in all, uh, to my, I think it was a good box for $28. I mean, that's just my opinion. Uh, I do want to say thank y'all. The channel is growing like a weed. Uh, I mean, it's really, I mean, it's crazy. I didn't think that it would be growing this quick. Uh, we're getting subscribers every day, which I really like. I'm not going to complain about that. I love y'all's comments. I love talking to y'all, getting to know every one of y'all. So the more y'all comment, the happier I am. If y'all have any questions, comment down below. Uh, if y'all would like to see me do something uh, in the tank or buy a Pacific box or something like that, comment, let me know. Uh, like I said, we got more of these boxes coming along with our monthly subscriptions. So I'm going to have quite a few boxes here and there. Uh, so anyways, make sure y'all hit that bell so y'all can be notified whenever I post a video. Thank y'all for watching. Thanks for taking time out of y'all's busy day just to come see me. And I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Till next time, be safe and have a good night.